Good evening, everybody. Thank you for coming out in front of your computer monitor. And uh, this is our uh, fifth, right, fifth uh, virtual mini concert, the beginning student of Japanese Gamelan Ensemble. Uh, as you know, because of the, the pandemic, the, uh, uh, the semester is being shortened in such way that we don't have enough time to play more than three pieces. Uh, fortunately for the students, uh, aside from uh, learning the music, they learn so much about Indonesian cultures, uh, puppet theaters, uh, uh, and uh, so many different things. There's a history of the Kamlan and so on and so forth. So uh, uh, we're going to play in the first piece. Uh, the title of it is Gajah Indro. And Gajah Indro, Gajah is elephant. Indro is the uh, god figure. It's always different interpreta interpretation what the meaning of that Gajah Indro. It can be both of them is a, a very strong figure. Gajah is strong, Indro is strong, but might also be the Indro riding the elephant. So our first piece is Gajah Indro.
switch around the instrument. Uh, the second piece is Taito Jagung Jagung. And uh, it's kind of very interesting that the name is a uh, sort of an associated with uh, agriculture. Jagung means corn, corn. So we're not sure how to connect this, uh, how actually season uh, named this piece. It might have something to do with uh, the uh, scene, the scene from the story of the Wayang puppet play. That is uh, the hermitage scenes in the farm, in the uh, uh, agricultural area the, it, when the scenes of that hermitage uh, uh, being performed, the piece accompanying uh, for that scene is a kaki tunggu jagung, which is uh, the uh, jagung in the corn. All right, so in this is the second piece, uh, jagung, jagung in Yogyakarta style.
the uh, last piece, you uh, student had to switch the instrument. One of the challenges of learning the gamelan is uh, that the piece is always the transition from one speed or temporal flow to another. And particularly in this piece that you just heard, because there's a, an interlocking in, one, in uh, a couple of the instruments, it's a, from being interlocking, making a transition to the regular playing in a different tempo, that's a, a challenge thing to do. The next piece, the last piece, is a bubaran. That's bubaran is meaning a disperse. This piece is uh, to be performed at the end of an event. And the uh, title of the piece is Runtung, uh, sort of like a neatly walking one after the other uh, when you uh, disperse from an event. So this is the last piece, uh, Runtung. Uh, just to mention, unfortunately, the Wesleyan is going to be locked down starting on tomorrow, so we will not be able to uh, uh, have uh, the last mini concert. Instead, we're going to make a recording of it, and we'll be playing, playing the recording on Monday uh, at 8 o'clock next week. All right, so the last piece, Runtung.
Sunday, or if not, it will be next semester. <laughs>